Hello everyone, today for one month from the 3rd of March until the 3rd of April we have set up a goal. We have set up one goal in specific. Let's say we have you made 1000 golds. And let's say you only have 1000 golds. Today we are gonna make well from those 1000 golds we are making 10 million gold. We're trying to do that within a month. 10 million gold, one month. That's the goal. So, I will go over step by step, day by day. You need Trade Skill Master add on. It's the best at the moment for making gold on the auction house. We only make gold on the auction house here today. We only make gold doing this. <laughs> Nothing else matters. Just making gold. Day by day, we'll make a small video. What you need to do, what you need to check. So let's just close my bags. So this this one here is essentially because it make it gives you sometimes a few silver, sometimes a few copper, sometimes a few gold. Unless you're quick, then you can make maybe 200, 300 gold doing this, because some people are silly and ridiculous. But we also not gonna vendor those from vendor search. We might resell them a little bit higher. So we need to check out preparing filters takes a while, apparently. No clue why. It should not, should not be normally. Okay, scanning. I recommend to do this on a high server, medium, or let's say, yeah, more too high than medium. Unless you know a few mediums that are filled with people that are close to high population, so then you can do that on medium servers. See, they sell six stacks of 20. Well, they're not all. One is worth. 12 silver 50 copper they sell it for less than 12 copper a uh, silver so you have a few coppers profit but it's a stack of 20 so you buy it it's, it's only this uh, that's sad so i was too late this is something we cannot resell because that there, there are only 80 sold around an average price that was just a little above so this ruined orb we make 10 silver profit and it's a stack size, stack size of 4. So we make 40 silver profit. You just buy these. Keep buying them. Um, okay, that's strange. That was strange. So these we're not gonna resell. We're just gonna buy them. This has a few silver. Always, always recheck. Sometimes they sell at the exact same price. Do not buy those. You can, but you waste your time. I'm always checking, especially close to the 100s. I always check. Even if it's worth two copper or one copper, buy it. You won't lose anything for just leaving it there. So this is now at one one gold, sixty silver. Just leave it. Go to the next one. They sell this for three gold. It's three gold. Just close it. Just close this. None of it we just bought can be resold for a profit. So just go to the mailbox. Open every mail, every single mail you can. See, we, we paid a little bit more than 80 gold for this. So if you have a vendor, if you have a vendor mount, just use your vendor mount. If not, go to a vendor. It's not that hard. Just sell everything. There you go. We made already two gold for 24 silver, 40 copper. So that I should have not done that. 
I should have not done that. That was ridiculous of me. Because we need that gold to buy and resell. Next. Sniper. Start sniper. If you just scan the last page, people that edit stuff. There we check how much they were, they're getting sold for, how much each day, and we can resell those. There's a lot more, so day one is gonna be more like this. Day two I will I will skip a few parts out of things that might not sell that well in this one day. Or might have not, not sold. You also have possibilities that you get undercut along the line. So yeah, sniper and vendor are two things you need to do each day. You can even do it, the vendor search, you can even do it every hour or every half hour. But you won't make that much gold for it. Well, you do make a little bit gold. Like, I made two gold, something. So this guy wants to sell jewel craft. I have this. I got it for free. It was a nice thing. Also, someone who misput something and they... they <laughs> and the buyout was one gold. Instead of a few thousand golds, so it was only one gold and a few silver. So I bought it. So I actually got it for free because I could, because I needed it. I didn't sell it, but I could have sold it. Why would that? Why did I pay my? Okay, for some reason sniping is not working as good as it should. Scanning last page. Nothing is here. Stop. Sniper doesn't work. Okay. Now, this is something you need to do as well. Just type in cloud or 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 bar or silk or whatever. All crafting materials. All crafting materials. Some people actually are stupid enough to sell them below. Way way undercut people. You buy these, you sell them for a little bit higher. Don't buy them to sell them for 5 silver higher, because you might lose that profit. Go at least 6 minimum. 6, six, or, six or 7 silver minimum. Outlook unclear. Gather 4,289 more Apexis crystals and ask again. We are on Legion. We are in Legion. If you want to go back to the shit shitload of Draenor, then don't go to Stormwind. You have an action house in Ashran. I can't just. I can't see this now. Wondrous Wisdom Ball. Think something might be wrong. Okay. Now you check. This is not worth buying or revendering. So now let's say Bull of Linen Cloth. Bull of Linen Cloth. They sell. Minimum buy it right now. Is this just double click? You see. So for one, they sell two gold. To gold 20 so you can actually buy these but I'm gonna leave them at the moment just gonna buy out this one there's only one for some reason it's stupid but now the price drops uh, change so here that it's 15 silver I am I'm accepting this I'm gonna take this with me to close nether reef yeah, I see three silver. It's not worth rebuying this. Windful clouds. It's not worth it. So yeah, these are things you need to do. You need to check. Have TSM. Because you can see if I should buy this cloth. 
there are only 0.04 sold average daily. So that's not worth it. So don't buy greens and resell them. It can work, but it can go horribly, horribly wrong. Like this, it's actually not worth it. I'm only checking what is worth to buy and resell. Linen cloth is too expensive at the moment, nobody will buy it that high. You can just... But there are more, more cloths that I have not. Rune cloth. We'll take and buy out this one. I check wool cloths. See, 18, 18 silver and they sell for 70 silver. You buy this. Make profit. Fell cloths. I actually never seen this sold well. Only three a day. Don't buy it. Now we go for the ores. Just type in ore, let it search. No, wait, 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 don't do that first. First, we need to resell them. Just open mail, loot everything. Go to your TSM if you already made groups and stuff, that's great. So. Make sure to add everything in. Now go to auction, start post scan. Will not take that long because we only have four items. So 38 gold incoming and for how much did we buy? I need to check for a second. So, 99 silver, so let's say almost 30 gold. Almost 30 gold. Well, it's 30 gold, so if you want to be check sure, just. Oh, it's actually 84 gold. So, yeah. This is. For just this, we made profit. If it sells. Will it sells? Yes. You can always set up things to the left. Favorite searcher searches. You can search exact things. And someone made it that night. Yeah, damn, someone made it that night. Then you can hear the people scream and shout things which you normally never care about. Yeah, the scanning can take some time, but it's it's worth it. Believe me, it's worth it. Same thing goes for plants, bars. But for sake of just showing you, we already made 25, 27-ish loss in, in our progress. So, the amount of gold here should have been a little bit higher. And tomorrow, when I will loot, you will see, well, get me close to a thousand again, or me at, or above a thousand. Today is a sad day, actually. Normally I can buy a lot, a lot more of these cloth. So, always check this one, no, no, don't do pets, it can work, and can also go horribly, horribly wrong. So what we need is like here, true silver ore, 15 or sold a day. If 15 or sold a day, I can buy this for 3 gold, resell them at 9 gold. I'm gonna risk that. There's a high chance I get it back. Gold ore, 15 each, each day. I'm not gonna risk it. It's, it's too small of a profit. Copper ore, no, that's not worth it. Iron ore, 80 each day. Okay, I can check. I need to buy these to sell them for a little bit profit, so I'm gonna leave this. 
Victorian are same thing. It's not worth it. Ha ah, here. Silver ore, twelve, no. True iron ore. These sell. 2370 this day. I can make a huge a little bit of copper. He's selling them one by one. Just buy them all. We're gonna resell them. Oh yeah, they they shift a little bit. So Mitral Lore 105, let's check. Four silver not worth it. This is why it's a sad day here, let's see. No, it's not worth it. Train or no. Mountain or no. Okay, we have the best parts here. So, again, close. Go to the nearest mailbox. And buy all the good stuff. We bought them for 1 gold, 80 silver each. We're gonna resell them for a few more silver. So we make profit here. And again, recheck. If, I, if you see me in a few seconds not recheck, it's because I already sold some of these. So I bought them for... 1 gold and 80 each, I can sell them for 2 gold 17 each. Which is almost 40 silver each profit. Now I'm risking myself with the true silver ore. So that's 170. If you can count, I'm already back at my thousand if everything is sold. So we didn't ore, we didn't. Fur. Here we check for fur from Draenor. That's not that much pages because they're not findable in class, so you need to type in fur. So do not buy any of these unless you want to risk it. Same thing as fur. Go for. No, it's too low. Arctic fur, no, no, it's too low. Also, things like fish from low fish, don't buy it. Now, this thing, it does sell for a lot, but a 0.06%. Well, average sold a day, it's too low. So, you need to know what you're doing. So we done the fur, we done the ore, we done the clouds, we didn't do the bars. I'm thinking, what else did we forget? Because I, sometimes I don't check everything. Like the flowers, I need to make a special group for that, for the flowers, but I need to have one of each flower. You can make groups and search those groups. So let's say everything I have right now in my TSM, in my group, I'm going to show you that later. So that's why this video is longer, because first day you check these things until you have them and put them in your TSM. So if you don't have anything, your TSM is empty, you don't have any mining, skinning, profession, name it, on any of your chars. Don't put them in. So two silver bar. I can make one gold each from them. But there's 24 sold, so I'm gonna risk that. So I bought them for three gold. Can sell them for a lot more gold. <laughs> Always check. Like checking is important. Here's 50 each day, but it's only one thing, so I don't buy that. I can risk and getting it higher but don't do that if i buy these two 
which are 16 and 25, and there's only average of 20 salts. Skip it. Copper bar. I'm gonna buy this one because there are 200 salt each day, and I can buy this one. So, those are a lot. They are 200 salt, so I can buy this one. Just to undercut it a little bit. So fell iron, no fell iron, not that much. Gold bar, 30 Ghost iron, cobalt bar, no, they're gonna be sold, but they're not that much worth at the moment. Okay, so we have everything right now. So get all these things, you have your basics. Remember, always you need your basics. If you don't have your basics. So these things are the basics. And again, check. Which I don't have, which is strange. So I have a lot of stuff in here already. And these things we're gonna check now. First we're gonna vendor these things we just have bought. So I bought those pretty cheap. I'm gonna sell them a little bit higher. Post everything, 250 gold is coming in. This was higher. You remember, this was higher. So you can just recheck if I restart. I will show to it, okay. Now, uh, shopping. Uh, I, need to go. I think I need to go to custom. No, social search reserves. Oh, here. Select all groups. With none of your groups have shopping option. Mm -hmm. Okay, I did not do that. Strange, I did. I totally did. Both exports. And. Okay, I'm gonna open this. Operations. Options. Sell. Operation 1, no operation. Auctioning. Oh, here's shopping. Create new operation. Operation name. Buy. Okay. Remax price. Yes, not including snipers. I'm gonna check that out later. So first we're gonna start search for stuff. It's gonna look for everything. I have 155 items in that already. Which is strange. So after a week when you collected a few more items, you can do all our dungeons, farm things, put them in your TSM, everything that sells, put them in. Like, you can include greens and blues. But only do that if you are seeing your gold rise enough to risk it. Because sometimes it can be sold in a day, sometimes it can take weeks. And that's all those gold you're posting in, in, your, in the auction house. At the end of the time it's sold, you actually paid the item to the auction house. So it's it's risky and i don't do risky N not now i can buy 700 gold for 600 or 400 gold stuff that are not gonna sell i can resell those things for a lot of profit but it's not gonna work When you see this, like page 6 or 14, it means things that are on the action house right now. So, of course, I might even be on the cut on one of my characters and I maybe sold something. Because I was not gonna, I was planning to do on doing this video two days ago, but I forgot. I, my mind was somewhere else. I did not. No, 
Um, I lost the thing I lost this. I was saying. That's a great job. That's why day one, longest video. Day one, day, the first week is the longest time. Because you don't have anything, everything in your TS, TSM yet. Get that in. I might have done something wrong with the options. But we're just searching when I'm more advanced. So I'm still not a beginner, but like in the middle. Yeah, I'm not gonna buy that. It <laughs> doesn't matter if you buy out or bid on it. Yeah, I can't bid on it, but it. 12 hours, one stack, one. Hmm. It's strange that they have rest. The items are not popping up yet. So there's one action of 200 stacks, which gives me one silver per, per item. So that's two, two silver per stack. But if I can sell one. Three gold, eighty each. I'm gonna bid on that. One copper each. I make three gold, something. Three gold, eighty silver profit. If I win, I need to win. I really hate bidding on stuff. I don't like it. So here is the thing I might have done wrong. I probably checked everything that's one copper. I've done something wrong. Okay, I'm gonna stop this. Ch um, gonna stop this. No, 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 I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna just bid on this. Someone already bid on it, so four silver, five, three, four. I can bid. It should show up in a few seconds. Maximum auction price per item. Yeah. One hundred and eleven thousand gold. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That it was set up on don't show items here. For some reason refreshing spring water is in it. Maximum price. So don't let, don't let, don't do this. Don't check on this. This is how you set things up. I'm interested in these. Can't double click it yet. <laughs> because these I normally sell for a lot higher. And now these that I just bought are going just a little bit above Fender. So. Things where you see like this, and here you're not, you have still the lowest price yet. So, price I guess is sold yet. I hope, I hope, I really do hope I don't get outbid. Some broken clouds, I can buy them, but they're already lowest, so I can't get them yet. So now we wait, we check everything, there might be sometimes blue or a green item that I might have had once. I 
and it will just you know, sort its um, auction by act per item. So the lower we go, it's Titan Steel Bar. They sell pretty good, actually, five for that price, average each day, so you can sell one. Don't sell 16 auctions, so. One small advice, like the Titan Steel Bar, sell them on a Monday or a Tuesday. Never sell them on a Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. The reason why is people do their raids in the weekends and when it's reset. There are a few people that do earlier. So these are all things I'm probably not going to buy out right now unless unless there is something that's at least 5 silver more per item. That's how I work. Stormant music. If you're watching through all of this, I'm sorry for the length of the video. It's a long video. <laughs> But it's day one. Tomorrow I will not do the separate things. I will only do the group search, defender search, and the snipe search. Cold notice selling great at the moment. And Broken Claw will probably be the lowest thing I have. Why did I even. Sold them, damn it. I sold them. So now, see, wait one sec, one sec, where was it? Where was it? Here? In the silk lot? I've been undercut. In the wool cloth, I have been undercut. The lowest seller shows here, if there's another name, you have been undercut. So, that's exactly why you need to watch out for some things. Because the greens, the blues, people can undercut you in, an, in a second. It's like, and you're undercut. The true iron ore we just bought, I said somewhere. Oh, we're not been undercut, it's because it's a switch. Okay, that's great. See, like peace, peace bloom. You can't find them if you type in flower. <laughs> so these things you need to get once in your pack, put it in your DSM, sell it. Oh yeah, the toot. They're going pretty nice for one silver and a of copper. only one silver more than their vendor price. So now last page is scanning. Okay, so now we check. Stupid sky. Okay, I'm not gonna buy them towards here. They don't sell that high. You you get un undercut immediately. So what I'm looking for is mage wave. It's not that great now. Shark. Yes. It's not that much. I can undercut. I 
going to undercut until here. Sweet. They also get sold a total of average 31 a day. So I can get 10 silver profit per item. I'm gonna do this this way now. <laughs> it's a lot easier. So I'll check from buff. It's probably. So ten for one, yeah, don't buy this. Do we check the mage whip? I think we did. Yeah, we did. But not worth it. The peace bloom. Buy and sell cheaper. I can buy these because these also sell for 70 a day. 15 silver each. I can sell them for 60 silver each. I'm glad. I'm happy. Here you can buy a lot. Okay. Maybe I didn't need to buy that much. I bought more than I hoped for. So this is the day. Okay, I can buy this. No problem. These I can buy. And I've been stupid with the flowers because there's no way I'm selling them all in one day. Well, you can't go overpriced like that. Just always check how much are sold. That's the important thing. Was 300, was it? Yeah, 300. So there I have no problem with buying a lot. So this is basically the main thing you do. Full scap. Uh, it does not sell. Fell blight. Fell blight is way too cheap at the moment. And there's only 58 and fewer. No. We have been undercut, so let's see by how much. By one copper. Copper or the No, it was not worth it. So silver leaf. Blue cloud, it's blue cloud, we've been undercut by the same guy. Or that guy. You see, you can make a huge profit, you think. There are only 9 sold a day. Don't buy this. You need to know what you're doing. Sim for Windwool, I'm not gonna buy it. No. Grand Arrow Bloom. Not worth it. Some things are worth it, some things you better leave behind. Who cares? Yeah, I can buy one for five silver, but that's that's below my own thing. So, doesn't matter. I can check for this. No, it's not worth it. Lay blots. Ember silk clots. My honor, I can buy these stacks here. The two actions of sex has one twenty and six that's too much, no. Don't risk it. Storm scale. Yes, that I can buy. Forty silver each with profit with sells. So that we're buying. And now we close. We almost bought for a thousand gold. So make sure you have enough to post it. I've been stupid with a silver leaf, you'll see in a second why. Uh, 
I have a lot of silver leaf right now. I have on my character 862. 862. That's, that's, that's too high. Chance none of there's a chance none of this will be bought. Just start your post scan. Things you bought and you're undercutting. See, we need to recheck the silver leaf and the peace bloom. So before we go, we go to shopping. Silver leaf. This is stupid. I'm gonna buy this stack. Yes, I'm gonna buy this stack. Peace bloom same. I make I make profit of these even though they they, they keep they keep reselling. Well, that's just that's that's just retarded. Selling them for fifty for fifty silver, and I can sell one for for let's say one silver or two or three silver, or maybe the. One for fifteen silver, so these people are stupid. Again, auctioning, start post scan. See I bought fifty for fifteen silver, I can sell them sixty seven silver each. He's doing thirty three silver, so I win. Now just post everything. The silver leaf might not help, might not be sold today. Internal auction error. That can happen. Can happen. So we need to. There is 1,246 gold incoming. I start with 1,000. I have 400-ish gold left. Thanks for watching. This was day one. Yes, this was day one. So make sure you put your settings in. I will do that. As fully of me. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a beautiful, beautiful day farming gold. Please don't undercut me. I don't like that. You don't like that being undercut. If you are this guy that undercut me. You're lucky. Next time I win.